Hello everyone, this is Roxas1359, and welcome back to Let's Play Sly 2, Band of Thieves. Last time, we arrived in Canada, finding the location of three clockwork parts, and getting ourselves all the bottles within this part of Canada. In this episode, we're going to be tackling Sly's mission, starting with this one right here, A Friend in Need. Sly, it's, it's awful. I can't believe it. Slow down, Bentley. What happened? Your hat's gone! Went out looking for a snack and got captured by Inspector Fox! Carmelita? She's here? Don't worry, Bentley. I know how to handle her. But I don't know where she's locked up, Murray. I'm used to having all the facts. Calm down. Carmelita's not cruel like the Contessa. I'll follow her without being seen. She's bound to check on Murray sooner or later. Okay, that, that's a good plan. Just don't get caught too. I don't want to be alone again. All right, so it seems Carmelita has captured Murray, and now we need to find out where exactly she's keeping him. So this adds in another aspect of Canada that we're going to have to deal with. Inspector Fox will be patrolling around Canada. She will take out any of Jean Bisson's mooks, so you don't need to worry. And you can actually pick her pockets. As you can see, she's taken, she completely vaporized one of Jean Bisson's men, completely. She is impervious to damage, so she does not die. And she will shoot you with her shock pistol if she sees you. So make sure she doesn't see you. And she is close to our safe house. That's very uh, worrisome. Okay, she's getting closer and closer to the safe house. I'm not liking this. She is at the door of our safe house. We are screwed. Unless she doesn't recognize the van. Which would be dumb because she should recognize the van because, you know, that's the van we've gotten away with in multiple times. All right, so she's down there and goodbye guard. Takes one shot with her shock pistol to destroy anyone in her way. <sighs> this is the boring part of the mission. The fun part comes when we get to pick our pockets. And you actually get a trophy for that too, but uh, that's besides the point. So this has nothing to do with the actual, um, what is it called? With the actual uh, heist. This is just, you know, getting Murray back. Yeesh, she's brutal and sadistic, just like me. She's having fun. Nope. Well, that kind of takes care of that guard. Kind of instantly vaporized him. And here's where Murray is. Hey, criminal, you doing okay in there? I know it's tight, but you won't get shocked if you hold still. I'm okay. And thanks for that bag of jelly beans. I was starving. Won't be long now. Once I bust the other members of your gang, we'll get out of here. I'm grateful for the jelly beans and all, but aren't you on the outs with Interpol right now? I'm an honest cop. Busting the Cooper gang will prove my innocence and show everyone that Constable Neela set me up. You mean Captain Neela? I hear she got promoted. Whatever. Just sit tight. I'm going to look for your pals. All right. Now, where's... Okay, there we are. Murray, I've come to break you out. Fat chance. This thing is triple padlocked and Inspector Fox is carrying all the keys. Come on, buddy. You know I'm an expert at pickpocketing. She's tough, Sly. If you manage to get a key, you'd better run for it. 
Carmelita's sure to notice and chase after you. Leave her to me. All right. So we have to steal three keys from Carmelita, who is now down here. She's coming back to check up on Murray, so... One. You can't sneak up on me. Oh god, she's running on the tracks too. No. It doesn't work. Alright. I'm not here. You cannot even shoot. Justice will find you. There's nowhere to hide. Swooping justice. Yoink. Now go and deal with the guard. No, 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 no. Woo! Oh, come on. She attracted the guard and herself. Just gonna hide up here. Ha ha! Stumped by traps. Wait, I'm out of. I'm out of the ability to use my cane. One slip up and you're mine. Yeah. And yoink! Whoop! I felt that thing. And there we go. Jail cotton candy. That is for pickpocketing three keys off of Carmelita. Now to just go and release Murray. Okay. Oh my god! She got hit by the train. Run forever, coward. Uh, I can. This place is very expansive and large. And I'm sorry, Carmelita, but I'm gonna uh, have to let out my friend. Okay. So let's go on up before Carmelita comes back and, you know, tries to stop us. That'd be bad. Right. And even though there's treasure, I don't really care about it at this point. So, here we go. Thanks, pal. I was getting a Charlie horse standing in that box. My pleasure. You know how I love to mess around with Carmelita. Yeah, that's weird. See you back at the safe house. <laughs> I love that comment. That's weird. So, there we go. That frees Murray for us to continue with the game. And at the same time, uh, Carmelita is going to stay on the field from now on and will be an obstacle that you have to deal with. So, keep that in mind. I didn't mention beforehand that it was going to be an obstacle. Now, where is Spice in the Sky? This mission is annoying. This mission is very annoying to do, if I'm remembering, if this is the one that I'm thinking of with the spice balloons, then this is a very, very annoying mission. Probably one of my more hated ones in the game. All right, and it's over here. You might recognize this area as where there were some bottles, so I had to maneuver my way around. And paraglide on down to Spice in the Sky. Okay, Sly, we need to break into the Iron Horse trains, but the only way in through the caboose is locked. To blow the locks off, you'll need to collect the ultra-unstable denatured spice gas from those balloons floating above town. How am I supposed to get up there to collect the spice gas? Murray's already commandeered this ice plane. Jump on its strut, and he'll fly you up to a good paragliding altitude. Oh, and strap on a special vacuum backpack. It'll automatically collect the spice gas after you've popped a balloon. Sounds like fun. Once you've collected enough gas, you'll have to land directly on the train's caboose. Why directly on the caboose? Denatured spice gas is very unstable at lower altitudes. Unless you land on the caboose, 
You won't have time to get the gas tank to the lock before it blows up. So you're saying I either land on the caboose or get blown to bits? Well, that's correct. Chemistry can be a harsh mistress. Well, this is great. And what's even more fun is the fact that my hat keeps on messing up in cutscenes. All right, so what we have to do is we have to hit these balloons. And I'm gonna... No! Oh, come on, I missed all the balloons. Ouch, I didn't even collect anything. Yes, I know, use my paraglider. That's what I was using and for some odd reason uh, I missed everything. The spice so, gas is lighter than air. Popping balloons should keep you aloft. Oh, come on. Turn around. Come on, hit it. Yes. F fill it on up. All right, and I fuck. Oh, I got it somehow. How did I do that? Back to the ice plane. Two more cabooses to blow open. So I got lucky right there because the ice plane is right here. But this is where the annoying part is. You have to go back to the ice plane each and every time for this mission. That's annoying. All right, so let us get some more spice balloons. Pop. All right, get more spice. Try this one right here. And made it! I'm doing pretty good so far. And I'm getting close to the ice plane too, which is perfect. Meet Murray at the ice plane. You guys are doing great. There's just one caboose left. Silent obliteration. And let's get the last one. I got lucky because I wasn't far away from the trains and the ice plane for these so I got pretty lucky especially on that first one I shouldn't have gotten that first one I should have died I wonder who keeps on lifting up these balloons in the same exact position that they were in when I first ended up popping them all right so that's one these balloons represent the greatness of Canada all right One more should do it. You're full up on gas. Target the last caboose. Can I do this? Can I do this? No! <sighs> yes, I know I have to land directly on the caboose. I thought I had that. And is it me or are the trains getting into the same position each time I end up doing this? All right. Yeah, they are. You're full up on gas. Target the last caboose. Oh! So close. That's twice I've screwed up and I should have seen this coming when I ended up saying I'm having a good easy time with this. Now comes the part where I start failing miserably on the mission. 
Luckily, it doesn't do, like, a mission failure and everything. It just puts me back on the thing. All right. And bop. Bop. You're full up on gas. Target the last caboose. Yes. Caboose. Got it! Perfect! Took me a couple tries, but I managed to open them all up. You guys did it! All the iron horse trains are unlocked! And job completed. That's all the jobs. So, where do we go next? We need to switch from Sly. And eh, some habits are hard to break, ladies and gentlemen. Oh! Medium nugget. We get gold nuggets now whenever we steal. We also get necklaces. Now I believe, yes, ride the iron horse. That is the next mission that we're gonna do with Bentley. But anyway guys, I'm gonna end it off right here. This has been Roxas1359. Next time we're gonna get ourselves to the first of the clockwork parts with riding the, uh, riding the iron horse. See you guys next time.